Let's learn how to effectively add a picture or graphic to a wiki hosted classroom website in five minutes or less. And I am on one of my course websites and here uh, we see a graphic over here but let's say I don't like that graphic and I, I would like to replace it. So what I'm going to do is first I'm going I'm to get a picture and uh, let's say that I want to put a picture of a, of a teacher on there and, and I can come here I just went to Google and typed in teachers and I get all kinds of great things and uh, I, I don't know let, let's say I like this one so I'm gonna click on that picture and I'm gonna point at the picture and uh, I'm gonna right click so that I can get the image URL or web address for this actual picture and uh, I'm using Firefox which gives you a copy image location and uh, I, I can do that probably better than just copy image so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna click copy image location and now I'm gonna go back to my classroom website and I'm gonna click into edit which any wiki host is gonna have and uh, I've got this picture over here and uh, I, I could edit this picture but let's just say since we're learning that we just get rid of that picture and we assume there's no picture here at all so I, I want to put a picture in and I can put it anywhere on my page so I'm gonna go ahead and I know I want it somewhere in the middle I'm just gonna put my cursor here and most wiki hosts have a, a handy toolbar up here so somewhere I'm just gonna keep hovering until I find it and uh, here I have insert edit image on my edit me toolbar and I'm gonna click on that and now I've copied the image so I'm gonna go ahead into image URL and I'm gonna right click and I'm gonna paste in that image and then when I click down here in the preview box I get the image and I could type in a description if I wanted to sometimes if you're attributing if you're saying where a picture came from you may want to put that in there uh, I'm not gonna do that for now I'm gonna go ahead and click appearance and up here I have alignment and, and this is important because I don't want my picture to hover in the middle and mess up my text so what I'm gonna do is I, I'm gonna come in here and if I click right you see it shows me over here what it's gonna do and, and that's pretty nice so I, I can do that uh, I could take it um, to the top to the bottom if I go left you see what it's gonna look like but again I'm gonna put it on the right and I'm gonna go ahead and click insert uh, are you sure you want to continue without including a description? I'll say okay, I, I will. And as you can see in edit mode, my picture's gone in there. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and save it. I don't know if I like it yet, size-wise, but I'm going to go ahead and save that. And I'm going to leave it there. Now, I could make it a little smaller. I might not like how big it is, so I'm going to come back in to edit and again I'm a, this time I'm going to click on the picture and I'm going to go right back and I'm going to go to insert edit image because this time I'm going to be in editing I'm going to click on the appearance and uh, all I have to do over here on dimensions I'm going to take this 300 down to 200 and if I click over here you notice with my constrained proportions checked it automatically fixes the entire picture I'm going to click update and OK again and you notice that has uh, taken that picture down quite a bit so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, save and close and and there it is and that is a, a quick and easy lesson on inserting images into your wiki hosted classroom website